To start a new document, select the Open menu. The centre section is where you pick new documents, which can be blank pages or one of these document types. I'm going to open a business letter design. The selection of designs will continue to grow. So now I can customise this document by adding my logo and my content. When you've edited a document and want to save it, you save it to your choice of Cloud Drive. Go to the Documents menu again and select Save, which goes to the File Picker. First select the Cloud Drive you want to save to. You can add different Cloud Drives here. As you can see, I have Google, Dropbox and OneDrive all connected. So I'll select to Save to Dropbox and select the folder I want. This shows you the path to the folder and this takes you back to the top. Anyway, I'll give it a name and click Save. If you have Dropbox on your computer, you'll see the Zara file is now saved. So if I now go to the Open menu again, now top of the Recent Documents section is the file I just saved. I'll pick a document that I was working on earlier. You can create and download a high-quality PDF. Select the Documents menu again, now download, and download as PDF. We provide three quality settings. I'll choose the lowest one, and I'll just tap Download. Within a couple of seconds, you'll get a download prompt. This depends on your browser. But I'll just open it. So here's my PDF. As you can see, it's super high quality. And that's on the lowest quality setting. But there's a more direct way to share documents. That's to use the Share option here. If I select this, it creates a web link to a copy of the document. And here's my link, which I can now share with anyone. This link is private, and only those with the link can read the document. Although you can make it public, so everyone can read it. Click the link to open a preview. So here's my shared version. This is not a PDF, but a perfectly accurate web version that is readable on any web browser. But suppose I want a colleague to edit my document. In that case, I choose Share Editing, and enter the email of my colleague. He'll get an invite to Share Editing. I can now see that my colleague has just joined. So now both of us are editing the document simultaneously. And here you can see he has just added a photo, and is moving it around the page. I see his edits in real time. Because this is my document he's editing, when he does a save, it's also saved to my cloud drive. As you have seen, it's a really simple editor that works on all devices and computers. It's a really fast way to create great quality documents, which you can save as a PDF or share online. And it has simultaneous multi-user editing. That's the power of Zara.